Hi, this is Antti from React Studio. We released an update to Firebase plugin which adds uh, interaction for tracking events. So the events are just uh, events that will appear on your Google Analytics or Firebase Analytics. So this is my uh, this is analytics view for my demo app, restaurant app, and uh, you can see there are there are events here. How to track them is simple. You just add a you just go to your app uh, in app project in React Studio. First, you need to update the the data plugin, the config file for Firebase. Just add a the measurement ID property there. It's the Google Analytics ID basically. Just add it there, and you can find documentation for that in the in the Firebase docs, official Firebase docs. When you when you done that, you're good to go. And uh, here's the first. Uh, event I want to track is when every time a user clicks a restaurant, I go interact, and here it is. It's under the component. Just log event, and here is the value. Uh, this will be the event. It's just text. So in this case, uh, user clicked restaurant, and then there's a data slot value here. So it shows the restaurant name in the event. And when I check this on the on the app itself. Uh, Let's go to the main screen. And if I click here, the event is tracked and it's added to the, the analytics. It takes a while uh, the events to appear here, but they will appear for the first time. It could be even 24 hours, but if you go to real time, you, you should see them pretty fast. So, so here you can see the, the events. And now there's uh, probably a new event somewhere. Let's see. Uh, which restaurant did I actually click? It was the food garden. Yeah, here it is. So there's a new event here, and how many times it's it's been clicked. So you can you can pretty much add events to all of your buttons on your app. And uh, in this, this case, I could want to have a event for when every time when user clicks the writer review view, and uh, every time when user posts a review, probably that that as well. And uh, what else you can do with it? Um, you can, if, if we check the code here, code class, and uh, how does the event logging looks? It's somewhere here. It's just one line of code. It's Firebase Analytics .log event. So you can use this code even even on your screen screen uh, lifecycle method. So just add it somewhere here if you want to track an event every time when screen is loaded or whatever you want to do it. So that's that simple way of logging events uh, on your Firebase app made by made with React Studio. Thank you for watching and uh, see you guys soon.